Hello there, YouTubers and slash blend.tv. Today, we are going to show you some great, great news. Yeah. But anyway, we thought we might show you, uh, well, they, in Sneeze Linux, they call it Blibica. In, in, um, well, in, in my world, we call it the British Broadcast, which is a real original name for the BBC. Um, but today, we're not going to talk about how good BBC is. Maybe. But anyway, we thought that we'd talk about Ubuntu's, or the review of Ubuntu by the BBC. And we're going to talk a review of a review. Yeah, that too. Uh, basically, the BBC's um, review, if you, if you live in Bre well, Britain, or somehow you could read the Britain's articles and stuff, then you might be interested that basically what it, what it talks about is that they've talked about how the Ubuntu operating systems moved on quite quickly, talk about uh, HUD to be more improved, uh, the Android, for uh, Ubuntu for Android sort of thing, and what's happening in the next generation, and so forth, and so forth, and so forth. I don't need to talk any more than that. But basically, this is kind of good news for anybody who's interested uh, to show off that, you know, there's a new Ubuntu operating system out there, it's in the media, and you can download it, try it out, um, you know, for free, for nothing, and it's not a big global operating system like Windows or Mac, but heck, it's a good distribution, and, you know, it's better, probably better than Mac and Windows. So I thought, yeah, I'll share this out today. Um, next thing I'm going to show you today is, oh my god, you're a bundle, we're going to show you how uh, this new email client called Gary, Gary. Launcher on, on Linux. Well, Gary is an email client like Thunderbird, um, free open source, of course. But it looks, it, it feels like a uh, phone text message instead of you know, like in Thunderbird. It was a little bit mm, not as good, but I like, I like, I like Gary. Was it Gary? Yeah, um, I like it because it's more easy to read. You can read all your emails. You've got more information and so forth. So going back and forth and so forth. So I think, yeah. Gary seems good. Looks good. Uh, I'll give you the PPAs at the end of, in the end of the show. So you, oh, well, it's in the description anyway. So you can download them and try it out for yourself. Uh, I'm going to put some keyboard shortcuts out as well, as on the bottom as well. So I'm going to add a few extras to it. And that's well, lots of news for Linux today. But uh, on the channel today, I've just well uploading. Or released to upload a a video, like I said, an Arch Linux install. Um, a couple of things first before I go into what's happening in the Arch install. First off, I know I'm sorry, the camera is crap. I can't afford one to get a good camera. I am. I apologize for the disturbance. But I said in my last video about the Arch install, or maybe it could be the first. I don't know, um, that, you know, I'll put the comments down below, and we'll get out, well, in the first one, it might be not what I said, but the second one, yeah, because the first one's very straightforward, it's just installing the OS, um, you know, all you have to do is just follow the links, and you'll get the idea, um, but in the next install, I'm going to show you how to install the drivers, and I'm going to show you install the programs and so forth and how to get y'all and all that great stuff in your lovely lovely arch system so um yeah so if you're using an Asus Aspire D250 then yes but I'm doing it every day so you know t today it's for part one tomorrow will be part two and the day after will be part three so just doing it in categories I can't put them all on on one line, I've got the daily news coming up, which I always do a daily news feeder of what's happening in the next today, and that's it really. So, I hope you have a good time and your good evenings. Uh, mine's almost over, <laughs> um, and have a fun time. Oh, yeah, and please subscribe and thumbs up or comment and join our community. I really, really love, I really, really doubt you to join because it's not because I really want you to join, it's the freedom I want to give you to join that's the point that's the whole point why I want you to join um or the freedom I can advertise to you really um so yeah uh join and have fun 
Bye, guys.